Good evening. Travellers are tonight playing a cat and mouse game with the police as the authorities try to guess when a legal hippie festival will be held in the West Country over this bank holiday weekend. The dozens of travellers' convoys dotted around the region and the police are expecting them to converge for the festival. But the police say they simply don't know where it will be. About 500 travellers were this morning still camped on a lay-by on the A38 in Gloucestershire. Their battered convoy had been escorted by police to Morton Valence to prevent an illegal party on nearby Rodborough Common. Up to 120 vehicles crammed the site. Police monitored the situation throughout the day. But the travellers say they only want a peaceful weekend festival before they move off again. One way or the other, we'll be having a party this weekend. The police can accommodate us or fight us. But nobody not. wants to do not, I don't yeah. mean the sort of like you know battens or anything like that but they can continue pushing us and pushing us but one way or the other we'll find somewhere to have a party this weekend done the anyway it would be better for them to save style, money taxpayers they? money poll taxpayers money and accommodate I mean, us rather than spend thousands of pounds trying to stop us you know. last night the travelers made a desperate attempt to evade police roadblocks in nailsworth mounting pavements in an effort to join other travelers who'd already made their way further north but police made many roads no-go areas as part of their huge operation to contain the hippie convoy. An estimated 1,000 travellers were thought to have swamped the county. In Stroud, all roads to Rodborough Common were blocked, despite travellers' claims they'd been invited to a party there. Some, however, escaped the police cordon and gathered near the fort, but officers have since moved the 30 or so travellers on. At English Bickner in the Forest of Dean, the council dumped earth at entrances to fields where hippies had started to congregate. But in Avon, where police have taken tough measures to keep travellers off Sodbury and other commons, all was relatively quiet. Only a few caravans had been moved on. After 24 hours in Morton Valence, the convoy is once again on the move to another location. And the travellers are intent that they will hold a party somewhere this weekend. Angus Scott, HTV News, Morton Valence.